coming alive What's up guys? How are you guys doing today? So today guys, don't be afraid to be different, have some fun, and be yourself guys, but yesterday's vlog was about uh, me talking to YouTube, and believe it or not, um, like if you guys remember, I lost that SD card, and then the day, the next day, I found it, so, uh, it kind of made me mad because I could have uploaded that video already, but I uploaded it yesterday, so it is currently Thursday, and I got three marks back today. They were all really good marks, so I am happy, but it is looking very nice outside right now. We don't have much snow anymore, so that is very good, and it's pretty windy. But yeah, so that's what is going on. So it's currently three o'clock right now and I just gotta upload my video. So I'm gonna make some popcorn and upload my video. Okay guys, so today I thought we should react to the weird laws in Canada. Okay, so the first weird law in Canada is okay. Um, in Vancouver, it was illegal to sell a stove on a Wednesday from 1947 to 1986. That is really, really weird, but that is not a law anymore, but it was a law back in the day uh, 1986 it ended so that is kind of a, a really really weird one because I don't know I've never heard of that before uh, living in Canada but I guess it was a law okay the next law it is in Alberta it is illegal for someone under the age of 15 to be outside with a guardian between the hours of 12 a.m and 6 a.m. in St. Paul, Alberta. I don't know. I That's kind of a weird one because what if you're like, say, um, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. Like, say, I, I honestly don't know. That's just kind of a weird one. I, I guess we're going into the next one. Okay, in Ontario, where I live, it is illegal to whistle in Petrolia, Petrolia, Ontario, according to the town's website. Yelling, shouting, hooting, whistling, or singing is prohibited at all times. Luckily, I don't live there, because that does not sound like a nice law to have. Next law. In Oshawa, it is against the law to climb a tree. If you, like growing up, you have at least attempted to climb a tree. I know I have. And Oshawa, from where I live, is like about an hour and a half away. And I've been to Oshawa. L luckily, I've never tried to climb a tree there, but I never knew that law. Next law. If you don't pay your hotel bill in Ontario, the hotel can legally sell your horse. I guess that was an old law back in the day, but I don't know. That one doesn't make any sense to me either. Okay. In Etobicoke, Ontario, it is illegal to have more than 3.5 inches of water in a bathtub. I don't know how I don't know how big 3.5 inches is, but that doesn't seem that big. So I don't know. That one is actually a really weird one too. In Oxbridge, Ontario, it is illegal to have an internet connection faster than 56k. I don't think they want people to have fast internet connection there. I I don't know. I don't know if I like if I lived there. I don't know if I'd be able to um, 
upload my vlogs or anything. You could get arrested if you drag a dead horse down Toronto's Young Street on Sundays. I don't know why you'd be dragging a dead horse in the first place, but I guess that's an old law. So we only have a couple more more uh, to go. So in Quebec, it is illegal to impersonate a foreigner. So I guess that was also like an older one because, or maybe that's still a new one, but I don't know, that's kind of weird, but I guess it does make sense in a way. In Beaconsville, in Beaconsfield, Quebec, you are breaking the law if you have more than two colors of paint on your house. Okay, that one is a really, really weird one. Maybe, doesn't make any sense to me. In Fredericton, it is, illegal, it is against the law to wear a snake or carry a pet lizard in public. I don't know. I, I don't know either. Okay, Nova Scotia. It is against the law for taxi drivers in Halifax to wear shorts or t-shirts. What if it's like... Oh, I... I don't know. Prince Edward Island. In Charlottetown, it is illegal to intentionally ring at any doorbell or knock at any door or in order to disrupt, disturb, or annoy any person in his home or place of work. So I guess that is kind of like Ding Dong Ditch. Uh, that was like a, a thing a while ago. I never did one of those, but <laughs> I don't know. I guess that's illegal. Okay. According to the current Canadian law, everyone commits an offense who makes, who makes prints, publishes, distributes, sells, or has in his possession for the purpose of publication, distribution, or circulation a crime comic. I honestly do not know what that means, but sure, we'll go with that as a weird law. In Canada, it is illegal to challenge someone to a duel and accept an invitation to a duel. So I guess that's also an old one, unless you're talking about like a fist fight, I don't, I don't know, that, that one kind of makes sense, I guess they didn't want anybody to scrap it out, um, but yeah. Do not try to square, scare the queen in Canada unless you want to be arrested. I guess the queen doesn't like to be scared, <laughs> I don't know, maybe she just doesn't like to be scared. It is illegal to remove a band a band-aid in public in Canada. Well, I broke that law. <laughs> I for sure broke that law. Offending on a place with a bad smell is illegal under the criminal code in all of Canada. Well, I don't know, like that's the that's the last weird law in Canada. So I don't know guys, but I'll catch you guys in the outro. All right guys, so uh, I just kind of like switched it up there. It might be, I don't, know, I don't know if it's black right now, but I think it is. But yeah, so I kind of switched it up from there, from sitting down to standing up. So if you guys like, like that better, me standing up, I don't know, just dislike the video, I guess. <laughs> But I know you guys already liked the video because you are a Malolian. So if you guys are not Malolians, what are you guys doing? You guys are absolutely crazy. But yeah, guys, so I'm just about to go get a haircut. Gotta chop my mullet off, I guess. Um, but yeah, guys, so check back for tomorrow's video because I will have shorter hair. But yeah, guys, so I'd best like to thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys all did enjoy. And if you'd like to watch another video, guys, be subscribed to my YouTube channel. Turn on my post notifications and smash that like button. Smash. Stay savage, guys. Peace out. I will see you guys in tomorrow's video.